So he's going to be the in lane number 6, 1 minute, 1 minute, 2 seconds, personal mess is running unattached. Run over Lewis! In lane 5, 48.83 seconds, personal mess. Today, Team Nakia Championship finalist, running unattached, Sean Rowe! In lane 4, 48.23 seconds, personal mess, 2 times, World Under 20 gold medalist, come on, Games Bronze medalist, from the next tracker, Jaheer High! In lane 3, 49.51 seconds, personal best, the 2018 World Under 20 finalist from Legacy Athletics, Malik James King. And in lane number 2, representing St. Augustine, let's make welcome Sean Callaway. So we can go in 51.24 seconds and 51.78 seconds of times on the bump at the moment. Hyde has come up to a fast start already on the shoulders of Sean Rowe. So Hyde with the advantage early here, just five competitors in this second section. The top three sure to advance. The next two will have to hope that their time is faster than 5.124 and 51.78. Jaheel Hyde continues to lead at the moment. Sean Rowe is next best. Followed by Roman Lewis in lane number six. But Jaheel Hyde shows his fast there in class there. The Olympian cruises into the home stretch from the rest of the field. Malik James King gets into the picture as well, but it's Jaheel Hyde from Sean Rowe and Malik James King, 49.54 the time for Jaheel Hyde to take the win in section two. 49.58 for Hyde, 50.08 for Rowe, 50.15 for Malik James King, 51.18 for Lewis, that should be fast enough to get him through, and that will mean that Lamar Murray's 51.24 should also get him through to the final. That concludes the men's 400 meter hurdle semi-finals.